Hello and welcome back to Stranded Deep, welcome back to Pacific Paradise and welcome back to this island. We find ourselves on last time. Last time we took the big raft, the very, very big raft, the cargo carrying raft that we have. The one that's now actually down in the harbour. And we took it for a little joyride around to the nearby islands. We went that way towards the starting island and we picked up some container panels from I think one island over and then one island to the right and then we went in that direction towards the lighthouse and beyond where we picked up another couple of container panels and on the beach there are two more container panels because I said what I would do is in between sessions go and find another couple so what I did is just one island down uh, beyond the starting island and took them from the big container that we saw on the way past excellent 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 great white bar and grill that is Hello. Yeah, still, still dead. Uh, food and water situation is okay. I made sure we were typically top with this. So what we're gonna go, uh, what we're gonna do is go down and hope we're gonna goo. Hmm. I have so many things we need to do, and my brain is just fighting over what in the next word is going to be. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So we're gonna go back to our summer home and work on the folly, the little uh, walkway up to the summer home. Um, we have, however an example of what we kind of need to do. So we do have a container. We have a small one unit container uh, that we built to store all of our crap in. And we do have the red containers underneath the house itself. And if you're joining us for the first time, hello and welcome. Yeah, we, we kind of have a treehouse going on. A very big treehouse, kind of a regular one station thing uh, going on, which is nice. But uh, if we if we hibbity hop this way, if we do a little run in fact, also, I kind of need to check my axes. Oh, 48% durability and 60. Hmm, I think we can do something with those to refresh them. So, as we walk past this lot, let's let's refresh the axes first because I've kind of um, kind of damaged them quite a bit. Yes. So this is the folly. Can we even use the steps? No, we can't. So I've I've already started breaking the steps away just to save time. Uh, and underwater, if we go under here, I've also started breaking apart this foundation. Now I'm gonna kind of need need to finish that off, so need to finish off demolishing that. But ultimately, what we have, if we go up here, is we have a rock walkway which we can take up to our summer home, which we built, which is the asymmetric house up on the cliffs. And we worked out the only way to build up on the only way to build up on the cliff is to build out from the sand. So you've got to build up and out from the sand and then follow your uh, follow your building all the way up here. And then once you're here, once you've got your foundations all the way up, then you can build the house out from there. You cannot build down, but you can build up. So keep that in mind when you're building things. I also took out the... Pop. I also took out the uh, foundation pieces that we had put in, or the floor pieces that we had put in, tying this to the rock. What I might do is use, hmm, I mean, I kind of like that. I do kind of like that, actually. It's a little dangerous. No, it works. It works. What I was going to do is continue the metal walkway and anchor it to the rock itself so it looked like this is anchored. But you know what? I might not do that. So this is what we need to do. This is what we need to adjust. It's kind of big and it's flat and it's boring. Um, it serves a function, it has a purpose, and it allows us to peer down at the water at the very edge of the island. So beyond the sea stack is the void. There's a bit of seaweed down there, and then there's the edge of the nothing. Nothing, yeah, it's basically just gmork and nothing else. So actually, no, I, I do like that. I, I like the way we've done this. So you can only build a floor above a floor, so there was floor under there. I took it all out. It's now sticks on the beach. But you know what? I like this. This this works. I think this can stay. This metal bit though, we're gonna need to do something about, which is why I got some container pieces. And there's also why I started breaking that apart. So what I think we need to do is probably not have two gas two full gas cans in my pants. We do need some metal though. I put all the building material in here. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three. Ooh. Oh, uh, what am I doing? There you go. There you go. Uh, so we're going to need foundation, foundation. Oh, sides on the top. Actually, I'm going to need quite a lot of that. Why don't I just find one with more metal in it? 
That seems like it's got... Okay, cool. I can't pants it, but I can take it with us. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. So we'll break those pieces apart. Now what we can do is build foundations into and almost completely under the sand. So that's something we'll do. Uh, but first, what I need to do is refresh these axes, because these axes are pretty broken up. I'm just going to get rid of these two, because they're in the way. So they're full, I can't leave them there, and we'll need to put them on the raft. But we do need to refresh the axis, so I'm just going to go to the crafting station. I'm going to find the plank station. So it's uh, a log. Okay, so we have... We need, we need four sticks. One, two, three, four. All right. So if we go over here, we should have a hammer, a log, a lashing, uh, the four sticks, iron spide here. So four sticks and then an uh, axe. So we have this axe, which is 60% durability. I'll put you there. And this axe, which is 40% durability. Well then, uh, what we should be able to do is craft the plank station. Okay, we'll do that. We've done this before. Okay, cool. Oh no, I've lost my axe and my hammer and everything. That's terrible. Let's put that down. Do pick up my axe. 100% durability. Okay, cool. 100% can go over here. I know it's going to rain. If it has that sort of, it's going to, oh, it probably is raining. Look up, look down. It is raining. Oh, it's not a storm. It's just rain. Okay, fine. So this is the 60% durability. Put that there. Um, don't need to do that yet, actually. So I'll just, again, can't quick craft it. It's here, plank station. Plank station. Pick you up. Give you a little beat. And then we have... Where's the axe gone? Here. To 100%... Oh, 99.8. Yeah, because I hit... Yeah, I get it. I get it. I get it. But 200% durability axes. Excellent. Oh, the rain! I wasn't expecting the rain, but we do need it for the water. I haven't been refilling the water stills. So the water stills are not getting any... What's in there? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, the water stills aren't getting any um, stuff put in them in terms of fuel. I wonder if we've got a lantern here. We can actually see what's going on. Um, that might be a good idea. I'll go get a lantern from... Actually, it's two in the house. What am I doing? I'm running away. I'm just trying to think where we have lanterns. Just so we can turn one on, pop it under the water and actually see what the heck we're building. Not for me, but for you, because I have to think of you guys. So, lantern, lantern, lantern. I thought there was one up here. There is not. Ooh. All right. Oh, there's some here. We can just we can just take one of these and use it. I'll do that. I'll do that. Uh, nope. Tap and grab it. Uh, turn it. Can I turn it on? Hold. Oh. Uh, drop you down. Turn you on. Okay, well... Mm, it's better than a poke in the... Oh, there we go. So it's better than a poke in the eye. Uh, but we can kind of see what's going on. So I'll take out the steps. Boom. One, two, a three. And then I'll take out the wooden foundation. So the wooden foundation literally just goes on the edge of here. Hopefully... Oh, <laughs> Oh, uh, this is too easy. Can I just put stuff in? No. That would be too easy. Okay, one, two, three. Hands free. Pick up the sticks. So if we go underwater, we can kind of see what's happening. Okay, one, two, three, four. So what we have are these foundation pieces. I'm just going to have a little look around, make sure we're not being chased by anything. Okay, so we got one foundation, two foundation. We cannot build... Uh, another foundation in this direction. Nor can we build uh, a floor under here. It just won't snap to anything. So that's a problem. We also, quite interestingly, can't just build a foundation near another foundation. It has to either snap or uh, be significantly far away before we're allowed to build again. Because all of that from the house all the way down to here counts as one contiguous uh, construction. So what we're going to do is uh, foundation, corrugated foundation, one. 
and then corrugated foundation. And that's that is just barely, barely popping above the sand. So I'm going to hammer that in. So we have two foundations. We're moving the whole lot back. And yeah, it's literally just touching the sand. If I break this, uh, chances are we will get metal back because the metal appears just above the surface. So it'll appear just above the foundation when we break it. Can I get my head underwater? Yeah, there we are. So we now have metal that goes straight into the sand. Okay, cool. Excellent. I'll probably put you out now. There we go. So what we're going to need is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, cool. Oh, the sun's back. It is 12.15 in the afternoon. All right, that's cool. So what I'm going to do is go to my walls and use the half walls. Two. Oh, no, 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 no. One. One corrugated scrap. One. And then corrugated half wall. Okay. So we'll build these two. So what I'm doing is just building slightly further back. This is all kind of floating in nothing. So with those two foundation pieces, it just kind of didn't look quite right. Uh, so we'll do that. We'll hammer this side in as well. This also has a neat neat thing as it brings it into the rock slightly, uh, which is kind of cool. So yeah, we have something that works. It functionally works, but unfortunately kind of... Uh, which way do these go? Sideways. Okay. Uh, that works. Yeah, it just doesn't look very good and we have to live with it. We have to live with it. It's our island and I want it to look good. It's like using the same coloured pieces of Lego uh, from the Lego box and not using just the higgledy piggledy bits. Uh, we can now build the steps. So we'll put the steps back in. I'm using plank steps instead of corrugated steps. Corrugated steps just are a sheet of metal, basically. It would work. But I just kind of prefer the look of the wooden steps. So I'll put the wooden steps in. And then we've got to do something with this, because it's still going to be a narrow walkway. Uh, and what I'm planning on doing, straight up, is... There we go. But you haven't done anything. Well, what we've done is we've made it one longer. So now it, it goes slightly further backwards. I need to take this out. I can't do anything with it while it's there. One, two... This will just eventually disappear, I think. Is that already gone? Ah, there we go. We did get some material back. Sometimes you don't get anything back from those. Excellent that we did those. That's kind of cool. Uh, I'll put them in the stick pile. One, two, one, two, three, four. Okay, excellent, excellent, excellent. So yeah, now we've moved this uh, back by one. So we should have some extra foundation. So it looks a little bit more chunky there. And what I'm going to do is put a container here. Hmm, why would you do that? Well, this extra piece means the container isn't just straight butting up against that. Although I don't think it would matter if it did. But let's go and get some doors and some stuff. Because, uh, why would we not? What's the time of day? It's two o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, fruit. Pretty fruity fruit. Have we grown any? Have we grown potatoes? <gasps> Have we grown fruit? And spoiled. Hmm. And spoiled. Okay, cool. But can we make gauze? We absolutely can. Medical gauze. Excellent. So we've turned the fruit into med medical gauze. Now, we can either carry these one by one. I think we will, because what we can do is just craft the door. The door should be facing us. Ooh, that should be facing us. I'm going to go and save. All right, okay. So the reason I'm going to go and save is because if we get the doors on backwards, and there's no indicator of if you're putting the doors on backwards, if you put the doors on backwards, it's easy just to load from a save than it is to hit the door 30 times with an axe. You'll get it back, but you'll also be hitting a door 30 times with an axe. So that's kind of fun. So much quicker just to reload if you, if you mess it up. So we'll come up here. We will save, but we will not sleep. And we will go down. Ooh, I know which way we can go down. Hey, uh, you missing something? No, I don't think I am. Let's run and jump. And then jump. And then hop. Oh, oh, lighthouse. Oh, 
we should be able to see the water this time because normally we do this first thing in the morning. Yeah, we can see the water. Ah, alright. I know you guys, well, at least some of you want to see this. <gasps> I don't know. Maybe, maybe we should just go back down the tree. We can just walk down from the wing. Yeah? Should we just walk down? Should we not do this? We can, we can absolutely not do it. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. All right. Well, I'll be better open your peepers for this one. Let's uh, jump. Don't play with your food. Undeniably a pain in the butt. A pain in the butt on so many levels. All right, okay, fine. We did it, we did it, we did it. We did the thing. It was the thing, it's the thing that everyone wanted to see. We did it, and I, I did it, and there's blood everywhere. What? Uh, so we can grab our hammer. Uh, contain the door. So the door should be facing us, as long as we don't rotate it. Um, what we need to do is we need to run, 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 run. Walk, 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 walk. Anyway, uh, yes, yeah, so we can either put it right here. So as we go up, we have to open the door. Hmm, that might be a good idea. Or we can put it like, we can put it one in. I'm going to put it one in. And the door are now facing us. And we can open the door. See? There you go. Ah. Oh. Uh -huh. Alright, that's interesting. So what next? Well, I need to go and get the other door. We didn't need to carry the door. We just need to get it. Uh, time of day is 16.35. So we've got about an hour and a half daylight left. What we should probably do... Uh, which one is this? Uh, this is a door. Alright. So, we're going to head this way. Alright. Don't adjust your TV sets. Yes, I did just right click and get rid of the thing in a crossfade. Yeah, someone's outside banging a bit of metal. And I'm just like, oh, hello? Why would you be doing that? I'm recording. That's kind of inconvenient. So we'll just get the container door again. Just have to wait for them to stop banging the metal. I think they were just uh, shaping it in the shape of a bit of bent metal. And also the sun's going down. I'm just like, oh no, the sun's going down. We're on the opposite side of the island for where the sun is. So uh, what we need to do is back up. So that's one, that's two. So I think, uh, yeah, there. And that worked. Okay, so now we have the frame set up. Unfortunately, it's 1736, so Bit of water situation is water is down, food is not too bad. Good, 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 good. We're gonna need some water. Let's put some water inside our mouths. Uh, we'll grab some from the farm and then we will head back to. Let's do this one, two, three, four. Yep. Okay, cool. And then we'll head back up to the house as the sun goes down on what was a beautiful day in paradise. Excellent. Oh, there's another plank station there. Hmm. We don't need the plank station, we just need to build it and then dismantle it to get the uh, the axis fixed. So we'll head up here as the sun disappears down. Whee! Alright, excellent. Duck down here. And the sun has gone down on another beautiful day in paradise. Everything is lit up, the harbour is lit up. Although the far our items don't quite light up as much because just of the way the way the game renders. If we get slightly closer, they do, and if we get slightly further away, they don't. Hmm. Which means the summer house from here is completely dark. Oh, we can kind of see a pixel of light, and then the effect on the trees themselves. Maybe we need to put more lanterns in the trees. That would be quite cool. Anyway, uh, yes, we are going to uh, save and then sleep. 
And we wake up and it is another beautiful day in paradise. SPF is all the way down. That's a bug. That is a bug. That just happens. 6.42, 6.43 in the morning. Food is down. Water is down. Now, uh, we could cook some food and stuff or we could not. I have a plan. What is your plan? It is a good plan. It is a reasonable plan. It is a plan made of plans. It is the plan all other plans are made from. What we can do is we can come down here. Well, these have only got one water in them. Weird. Like, all the other stills seem to be getting stuff. Those ones don't. Auto. Whatever. Uh, okay, so. Smoke large fish meat. Nom 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 nom. And everything's all tippy top. Excellent. Oh, look at this. We can grab the hammer and we can craft a container wall. Now, I think what I'm going to do is actually grab the container wall and run with it. Because it's less obtrusive than a big red glowy thing. A big red glowy thing in the middle of the screen. Yeah, we're going to do this a few times. So I, what I should have done is probably brought them back the other way. But that's where the raft ended up and that's where we ended up putting it. Oh, the little baby raft. So you can go in the water. Sploosh. Uh, yeah, the baby raft. All right. Hmm, that's a leftover from when we built the lighthouse. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm keeping it. It's just kind of there when we were using rafts as stairs. And then we kind of refined the whole thing and just made better stairs, I guess. So, I'll grab this. Yay! Oh, well, I guess we have to walk from now. Uh, it's better to walk for a little bit, and then we can run. Hmm, I don't know whether this is better than... Let's do a little walk. I don't know whether this is better than uh, just having the big red glowy thing in the middle of the screen. I have no idea. I got no idea. I will drop you in the water too. Sploosh. Okay, cool. And we need the other bits. There's a couple of bits over here. Ooh, this oh, hello, buddy. Let's get one of our nice new axes. And we're going to have to take this lad out because he's just going to chase us around. One, two, three, and four. There we go. Dead crab. He was a crab. I know he's dead. Oh, no. Well, I mean... Goodbye. It's kind of a, an undignified end, but... Hear me out. He was a butthole. Given the opportunity, he would nibble our butts. And I'm just like, I don't like that. I'm not into it. Huh? Give me the things. Yeah, I should really put these in the right place. But this is not... Uh, um, but, 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 this is not how people normally build. They would have to do exactly what we've been doing, which is grab all the stuff, move it to an island, and then hopefully carry it on, on the heads. Hmm. All right. Um, blah. Okay, cool. It's four panels. We need the last panel. Ooh, okay. I will move slowly through the undergrowth. Oh yeah, the house. The house, the house. We can, we can't see it from here. Oh, there it is. Yeah, we should probably put some lights in the trees so it all lights up at night so we can see it from the big house, from the tree house, summer house, from the tree house. It's good. Everyone likes everyone likes a nice nice house and a lighthouse. We've built quite a few houses on this island. Hmm. We have built quite a few things on this island. Didn't think we would, and then we did. All right. Two hundred thirty-eight days survived. It's a it's many days, and now we're out of stamina, so we have to wait for all of the stamina to recover before we can run again. But don't like. Um. Yeah, I'm not I'm not keen on the stamina system. Let me. Let me run. Okay, wall. The reason, so the reason we're using these container panels is not because we couldn't use anything else, but it's because I really like the difference in color. I just like the, the difference in color and texture. And also because if we do this and this, and then this, and this. Oh, quick craft. There we go. It, what it does is it looks like there's something big on the back 
of the okay yeah it looks like there's a huge like mass on the back of that which supports all of this it makes this look less like it's just kind of floating out to sea and more like this is anchoring it so this just looks like it's, it has purpose now it has absolute purpose now what we can do is we can put a roof on it two two types of roof we can put on there we can put a metal roof which would work quite well but i think I think what we might use is planks if we have enough. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Yeah, we do. We do. Only because it's a different texture. And it's a legitimate different texture. And everywhere everywhere else we've done this, we've put planks on the roof. So, planks on the roof for us. Excellent. So, we'll do this. Uh, roof plank. Planky roof. And another one. So, it gives us a little tunnel to walk through. It makes it more interesting. So, it not lost any functionality. It still has all the functionality that it had before, but now it's just a little bit more interesting. And we can continue to make it a little... I mean, we need to make it a bit more more interesting. We can. By counterbalancing the bit at the side. Okay, so these two are now on. Excellent. Yeah, it just breaks up the lines, breaks up the silhouette. It makes it more than it was before. Yeah. Yeah, it does look like this is now a little bit more firm, and this is just hanging off the edge as a cantilever, rather than it was just floating. Yeah, I'll take cantilever over just floating anytime. Okay, we're going to need to put some lights and stuff on there, but wait, there's more. Of course, there's more. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, the question is, would this work? Mm, don't know. Well, it depends what you're talking about, doesn't it? Yes. Okay, cool. What we can do, blah, close you. Uh, what I'm gonna need to do is do the thing that makes us do the thing. Right, okay. Um, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. I want that, and I want that. Wedge. So I think that, that, and that. Is that four? I bet it is. Oh no, it's three. Uh, ba 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 ba. Is it three? I want the floor sections. It's three. It's three corrugated scrap. So I need three, six, nine corrugated scrap to finish this off. Is that a storm rolling in? Mm, no. Looks like it's just getting a little bit dark. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, ooh. We're running a little low on metal. Well, of course we are. We've used a lot of it. Uh, it's just counterbalancing this side. So there's, this side is kind of poking out. And I'm just like, yeah, we probably should do something on the other side. We could leave it. But every time we get close to it, it's going to tell us that we can like finish off hammering it. So what I'll do... No, yeah, we could, technically. Just leave it like that. We could just leave it like that and it'll be fine. I... I'm not going to. I'm going to hammer it in because otherwise parts of my brain are just going to be like, it's unfinished. I don't want it like that. But this is a motif that we have on the big house. We were just up there and we were standing there and we were uh, we were looking down using our little, little veranda, little triangle veranda. Which is nice. Triangle balcony, actually. Not a veranda. Ooh, did I just mess myself up? Yeah, all right. So we'll just hammer this in. We got three more pieces to go in, so it's not too, too bad. And we just blew a, blew a hammer out. Ooh. I'm sure we got more hammers somewhere. We keep finding the things. Otherwise, we'll just have to build a hammer and then use the plank station to repair it. A uh hole. -oh. Using a crude hammer. Nah, eh, it's not a problem. Right. Excellent. So, last piece in. Three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bonk. Okay, cool. Yeah, alright, that's fine. So the question, does that work or does it not work? That extra section. Uh, probably works. Yeah, it's fine. It looks fine. We, what we could do is actually put like a little wall or something here. Hmm, 
Might be a good idea, actually. It's a little, little bit of a wall. So we could put a lantern on it. Um, I think we can. I think we can absolutely do that. But do we build it out of... Where else have we used metal before? The lighthouse. We've used metal on the lighthouse. What would we use for an upright? I think we just use other bits of metal, don't we? Woohoo. All right. I'll go and check the lighthouse real quick. Uh, SPF is not too bad. Not too, not too good, but not too bad. So we'll run through here. Ooh. Ooh. Can we eat the potatoes? The potatoes gone bad yet. Um... Yes, they have. They're spoiled. Uh, oh, I don't like it when the potatoes get spoiled. Oh, yeah, the uprights on the lighthouse are metal. Okay, fine. So we can add a metal upright to the... I mean, I do like I do like the stuff that we've built out over the sea has been rusty metal. Oh, can't get through there. So we'll go up here. Make sure we don't completely run out of stamina. And then... I like having the doors. I'm going to be honest, I do like having it. So this bit here, not quite, not quite beautiful. Half wall, just in the middle. Okay, and we hammer that in. But wait, there's more. Yeah, of course there's more. There's always more. Of course there's more. All right, cool. Now we need some lanterns. Ooh, going to need some lanterns. There was one... There's one here. What do I do with it? Oh. Ah, that is a question. I don't actually remember what I did with that lantern. Did I pick it up? Did I throw it in here? Did it get knocked? Oh, uh, did it get knocked into the... There it is. Yeah, I think the, the, the metal kind of knocked it in, knocked it around. Right, so we just need two sticks. Because then what we can do is craft a hook and then put that on there so that is now an upright that has a lantern on it and we'll grab some more lanterns how many lanterns do we have that is an excellent question i was like wait a second what are you doing here well not a lot come with me come with me if you want to live no wait he's dead um Mmm, there's only one no necromancer. What's that? Someone who romances your neck? No, you're thinking romance in the stone. Wait, what? Um, nothing, 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 tra la la. Uh, lanterns. I know I have lanterns. So oh, are they in the storage? Ah, probably in storage. Food and water situation. Okay, not too bad. SPF looking not great. Mm -hmm. All right. I mean, uh, actually, no, we can do something with SPF. That's not a problem. Uh, okay, cool. Other storage. Lanterns, lanterns everywhere, except for in my pants. There we go. I'll do. Got three lanterns. We just find them, and then eventually they just go into storage. Uh, okay, SPF. What is the time of day? S oh, SPF's going to sort itself out, because it's going to be three o'clock before too long. So don't worry about SPF, that's not something to worry about. I will get rid of... Ooh, oh we got some lashings here. Let's grab those. Let's grab some sticks and get rid of the metal. I think we can do that. Burr, 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 burr. Done. Alright. So, got a slight problem because in here there's going to be no light. Yeah. Can I put that on the wall? Yep. Okay. Lantern, lantern, and then ah, it's kind of... I don't know. Let's grab you off there. Let us knock you until you are fallen over. And then I will take you out of the middle, because I don't think you need to be in the middle. Now, do I need a hammer for this? Wood hook. No. I don't think I, uh, I, don't think I need the hammer in my hand. Ooh, I got so much stuff in the pants that's causing problems. Okay, you now it's in a weird place. Is the old hooks crafting? Where are you? Light hook. And there it is. And what I'll do is I'll put you on the edge. Let's see. Where is the where is the edge? Where's the join? Where's the pattern repeat? So it is here. 
Okay. I'll put you there, and then I'll put lantern on you. There you go. Thumb. Oh, and it didn't use anything up on the floor. That's a shame. Okay, we'll go up here. No. Yeah, okay, fine. So now looks a little bit more like there's something... I'm not entirely sure about the apron around the back. Hmm. Maybe I'll maybe I'll clip that all off. I think that's it's made it a little too wide. This is fine. I think what I might do is take all of this out and then just tidies that up. I think trying to go too, uh, trying to add too much detail has probably made it a little bit too big. But I do like I do like the container and I do like the extended uh, the extended back. So that, that means that all of this doesn't look like it's now floating. And it, it's, it obstructs vision. So you can't just peer all the way down. I think moving that light pole... Yeah, I'll, I'll take out those uh, sections of corrugated metal. I think that'll be fine. I'll do that in between episodes because otherwise that's me smacking some up for 30, uh, 30 hits. Now, can we... Ennui? Light hook. Can I put a light hook just anywhere? I could put one here because there's a foundation underneath. All right, that's what I'll do. So there's a foundation, which is why that's very, very low. Put that there. And that, that lantern, that lantern's sole job is to light up this foliage because from the house, any light that hits the foliage will light up. Any light that hits these walls will not. So even though we have a lantern here and a lantern here, we could only see the glow from from the foliage when we were in the house. We couldn't see the glow from inside the the, the room, the walls or anything. We couldn't see we couldn't see this. I think we could see a pinpoint of light, but we couldn't see anything else. Ah. Oh, I mean even though the sandstorm weather effect is on, which is why everything's kind of very dark. But there's no rain. If we look up at the sky and look down again, there's no rain. So the house is looking pretty sweet. Uh, the lighthouse is out there and it's also looking pretty sweet. Hmm. I don't know. What I'll do is I will let my mind work on that little apron thing on the other side of the T-section. If I don't like it, I'll get rid of it. If I like it, I'll keep it. But, I mean, it's the same thing with these steps. We changed these steps out to be ceramic steps. We had wood steps before, but I wanted to, to match the roof because why would you not? Excellent. So, I think we've come a long way. We've done a lot of stuff. Uh, excellent. Oh, these steps are a little bit more dangerous now that you can just fall straight into the sea. Nah. All right. But yeah, that means this actually has some purpose and having just this as a walkway like a little step through I really like that I really like that and I'll tell you what can we can we add a lantern there I'm wondering if we can we're gonna need two more sticks hmm one two okay got the two sticks uh can I do that and can I put a lantern on it? And is this going to work? It is 17.55, so this is all getting super dark. I'm going to work the torch out already. It's all getting super dark as the sun goes down and what was a beautiful day in paradise. Because the sandstorm weather effect is on, it gets darker very, very quickly. 18.03, my watch has come on, and this is all now lit up. All right, I put this out. Yes, I can. So we have this as a doorway. It doesn't lock. It doesn't knock the lantern off because I guess the lantern is not a physics object at this point. This all lights up, and it doesn't matter if it doesn't from a distance because it is there to guide the player. This lights up. This lights up, even though I don't really want to be over a nightmare sea. Uh, this doesn't, which is spookums, going to be honest. And then a little darkness before we get to the summer house. Okay, fine. Summer house looks quite nice. Once you're in it, it looks quite nice. And then this lights up the foliage. And the tower is lit up. Can we see anything from here? Yeah. 
So you can't see anything in the house, even though the house is all lit up. But you can see the effect on the trees. So we'll go back to the house just to just to finish off the episode. I don't know how long it's going to be because I had to pause part way. So, hmm, I don't know. We'll go through. Did we close. Let's close the doors. Close the door. Close the door. We'll do it. So the closer we get to the house, the more it actually lights up for us, which is nice. It's nice, nice, nice. The further away we get from the summer house, the less that lights up for us. So it's to do with where the player is in the world, really. Uh, so let us uh, jump, hop, skip and jump. I can put that out. Stop it waving around everywhere. And uh, we we'll go up once, twice, three times. And the effect is yes. Oh, yeah, look. The container now lights up the foliage from below and the lantern, that one lantern we put outside the house, now lights up the foliage where the house is. Nice! Excellent! Excellent, excellent, excellent. So the house is not just sat like a dark mass on top of the, the thing. Anyway, uh, yeah, so I'll think about the apron bit um, uh, in between episodes. If you like these videos, definitely leave a little like, leave a subscribe. Uh, if you do subscribe, click the little bell. Dingle the bingle if you want notifications when videos go live. Don't dingle the bingle if you don't want notifications when videos go live. You can be subscribed and not have notifications pushed to you. That's absolutely fine. And I'll tell you what, I'll catch you next time.